What's going on guys? GTA for Life 6996 here. We have a video. Um I'm pretty much just gonna be sharing my squad because now you can see I'm an 88 overall now. And we're just gonna be going ahead and <clears throat> uh pretty much just sharing our squad <laughs> like team update. Cause what I did was I did a uh another journey solo on another account. So I kinda just like transferred my players to my other account. And then when I was done, just traded them back. It's it's a bitch doing that because it it just takes forever for the loading screen to you know. But you know it's worth it because you know pretty much it, it takes me like five hours. It took me like five hours for to finish this journey solo too. So yeah, and then ended up, ended up making like 200k. So definitely upgraded my team. I don't know what I don't know how I got 200k and my team isn't. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah all right. So, <laughs> we're going to start off with offense, and yeah. Alright, so, we did have Tyron Smith, but we got Jason Peters. Pretty solid car right here. Um, and yeah, James Carpenter. I think I'm, like, going to save up a little bit more and then sell him and get uh, Josh Sitton, because Josh Sitton is, like, way better stats. Um, Max Unger, good center right there. Um, I can't sell him, so. Zach Martin, who's, like, probably the best right guard. Like, I don't know if... I haven't really checked on any other right guards. I might though. I don't, I don't know. I don't, don't really want an 86 starter, but like I said, um, Rick Wagner. He only had 80 run block, and but he had like 96 run or pass block. But um, we just had to get Brian Balaga because his stats were like way more balanced. Because he just he couldn't run block for nothing. We got Tyler Eifert back. Um, guys, a beast catches everything. I, I'd rather have him over Jimmy Graham to be honest. Um, and then we got Amari Cooper. Um, we didn't end up keeping this. We actually bought him for like 30k. But anyway, yeah, sick card right there. Fast as hell. Good catch. So good card. Jordy Nelson in the slot. Um, DeMarco Murray. Guy's a beast, man. He breaks so many tackles. His speed is, is surprisingly not a problem. Like, he could outrun defenders. <clears throat> I was thinking about picking up Le'Veon Bell, but, I mean, Le'Veon Bell is, like, 80k, and he's, like, 40, so. Yeah, I don't really want to. Anyway, we p p picked up Eli Manning. Um, We had Matthew Stafford, but Matthew Stafford just wasn't doing the job for me. Like, I don't know. He just missed a lot of passes, and if Eli Manning does, I don't know what I'm going to do. Probably pick up just, like, a Tony Romo and just, like, yeah. But uh, we're going to try out this Eli, because Eli's cards have always been good for me. Way back since like Madden 15, so give, give this card a chance. Delaney Walker at fullback. We did have Bruce Miller, but he was like 17k, so I just decided to sell him for a quick 20k or 17k. All right, we got Marquise Colston. Guys, a beast catches everything, so good card right there. <coughs> That's gonna be our offense. Um, so let's go ahead and get into our defense, which is pretty be pretty beast, pretty dope. So, we got Harrison Smith at free safety. Um, he's pretty goon. Um, yeah, his card is dope. Uh, Dante Hightower. I mean, you just cannot run to the left on off. Like, you just cannot run because they'll just, like, stuff you. He just, like, blocks or, like, shed student lines. Do whoever's blocking them and just, you know, stuff you for a loss or something. <clears throat> so, great card right there. Bowman. Great card to use her with. And, um, yeah, he definitely makes the stops. And he gets a lot of picks for some reason. CJ Mosley, because I run a 3-4, so CJ Mosley is pretty beast to use with, too. He's fast, so good card right there. We have Julius Peppers. I was thinking about keeping just, like, rolling with Ryan Kerrigan, but Julius Peppers, guy's a beast. Just had to pick him up. If you compare him, he, he beats him in a lot of things, so, you know. Yeah, great card. I thought his block shit would be a little bit higher, but, you know, 75 kind of weak anyway he has some good stats overall though and uh yeah Rashad Jones a strong safety I really wanted to get the uh 88 overall Will Hill but I mean he's like 60k and Rashad is like 40 so I don't know um Chris Harris I just had to get Chris Harris I was thinking about just picking up Patrick Peterson again but uh I was like yeah let me try someone new <clears throat> and Chris Harris makes plays for me like if you throw it up deep on his end he'll swat it out and in, and in some cases, he'll, like, pick it off. So, great card right there. <coughs> yeah, 92 play recognition. Yeah, got him for, like, 54k. Next up, we have DRC in the slot. 
Uh, slot cornerback. Jarrell Casey. I was thinking about picking up Chandler Jones, but... I, I don't know. Like, I might. I actually might. But Jarrell Casey's like 12K, so it's really nothing to pick him. Like, I can't really sell because Chandler's like 35, so, yeah. Gerald McCoy, he's just an impressive defensive tackle. Like, if you use her with him, he'll get through the line quickly. Unless you're running like a, you know, Travis Frederick at center or something, I don't know. Cameron Wake, he's so fast. Like, I, I've never seen someone who could just, like, catch up with, like, like, I've actually went into coverage with him with, like, tight ends and stuff. It's hilarious. Um, he, he just cannot catch, though. But, um, uh, Vontae Davis at cornerback, too. That was a sick cornerback. And, um, yeah, that's going to be our team. Um, stay tuned. If you want to see our specialists, we got Justin Tucker. People. That's going to be our team. Um, stay tuned for more Madden videos and just videos, period. <laughs> um, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.